Without a doubt, Lucille Ball has earned recognition as one of Hollywood's most beloved stars. Her groundbreaking work in entertainment left an indelible mark on the industry, forever changing the landscape of comedy. This video offers a closer look at the life of the producer, revealing both her comic genius and her famously fiery temper. Colleagues who worked alongside Ball have shared stories attesting to her explosive outbursts on set. Despite these challenges, the cast and crew remain dedicated to bringing her creative vision to life. Through interviews and personal accounts, this classic production pieces together a complex picture of its star, offering insight into what made her tick. Throughout her illustrious career, Lucille Ball faced numerous obstacles, but she never let them stand in her way. Instead, she used her drive and ambition to push past adversity, paving the way for future generations of performers. By examining the highs and lows of her journey, audiences can gain a deeper appreciation for the lasting impact this trailblazer had on television and film. However, working with the producer was not always easy. Tony Randall, a guest star on the show, described her as having a stern demeanor and a commanding presence. This intensity could be challenging for some, yet it proved effective in saving time and enhancing the quality of the show. The producer had a clear vision and an unwavering focus on delivering excellence. Her approach often pushed the cast and crew to meet high standards, resulting in a show that resonated deeply with audiences. Even with her strict methods, many appreciated how her leadership led to memorable performances and a tighter production schedule. Known for her dynamic energy and intense focus, Lucille Ball was a force to be reckoned with both on and off camera. As a producer, she demanded excellence from those around her, including herself. This drive for perfection was evident in her interactions with co-workers, where even small errors could elicit swift responses. Take Keith Thibodeau, who worked alongside Ball during his time as a child actor. He recalls the pressure he felt under her watchful eye, citing instances when she would directly address any missteps made by cast members. Her stern rebukes left little room for ambiguity regarding expectations on set. Yet despite these challenging moments, Thibodeau also speaks highly of the valuable lessons learned while working with such a strong industry figure. The legendary star's unyielding approach extended beyond verbal corrections. She pushed boundaries and took charge behind the scenes, shaping various aspects of production. From casting decisions to episode plots, her influence played a significant role in bringing each project to fruition. And although some may have found her methods intimidating, few could deny their effectiveness. Indeed, it seems clear that Lucille Ball's legacy extends far beyond her iconic performances. Her impact can still be seen today among producers striving for greatness and refusing to settle for less than the best. Lucille Ball was known for her fiery temper, which could strike with precision according to her colleague Vivian Vance. This trait revealed Ball's ability to deliver sharp rebukes and pinpoint personal weaknesses in others. However, there was another side to Ball's personality, one of loyalty and kindness, especially towards those she respected. Her friend, comedian Carol Burnett, also noticed this duality in Ball's character. The producer's temper wasn't always on display. In fact, Ball often went out of her way to help those around her. She used her influence to advocate for better pay and working conditions for her colleagues, even if it meant standing up to powerful figures in the industry. At the same time, Ball didn't shy away from giving constructive criticism when necessary, believing that honest feedback would ultimately lead to growth and improvement. One notable example of Ball's kindness involved actress Betty Phillips, who appeared alongside Ball in several episodes of I Love Lucy. After learning that Phillips struggled financially due to medical bills, Ball quietly arranged for a portion of the actress's salary to be set aside and placed into a trust fund. This act of generosity allowed Phillips to receive regular payments long after her appearances on the show ended. Similarly, when faced with a decision to recast the role of Ethel Mertz for the I Love Lucy television series, Ball stood by her friend and fellow actor Vivian Vance despite initial reservations from network executives. Recognizing the value of their partnership both on and off screen, Ball fought for Vance to remain in the role, solidifying their friendship and ensuring the success of the beloved comedy duo. These stories illustrate how Lucille Ball balanced her fiery temper with acts of kindness and loyalty. Although her sharp tongue was legendary, it was her compassion and advocacy for those around her that truly defined her character and left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. Indeed, Ball proved herself to be more than just a talented performer. She became a true champion for her peers and a trailblazer for future generations of artists.
Renowned actress Shelley Winters, who had the opportunity to work with Lucille Ball, spoke highly of the producer's comprehensive understanding of production details. This testimony serves as evidence of Ball's unwavering dedication to every facet of her show's creation. Her meticulous attention to detail was truly remarkable and demonstrated her deep commitment to delivering high-quality entertainment. On the other hand, Desi Arnaz, Ball's husband, shared her fiery temperament but expressed it through his own volatile and impulsive behavior. Their tumultuous personal and professional relationship was undoubtedly complicated by their similarly passionate natures. However, despite these challenges, they managed to build a successful career together, leaving behind a legacy that continues to inspire generations of entertainers and audiences alike. Their chemistry, both on and off screen, contributed significantly to the success of I Love Lucy, one of this classic's most beloved sitcoms. Despite their occasional disagreements and conflicts, the couple recognized the value of working collaboratively towards a common goal. Together, they pushed boundaries and revolutionized the television industry, paving the way for future producers and performers to follow suit. Arnaz's tempestuous personality may have been challenging to navigate at times, but Ball remained steadfast in her pursuit of excellence. She understood the importance of each creative element coming together to produce something truly special. In turn, she inspired those around her to strive for greatness, creating a lasting impact on the entertainment landscape. Renowned for her meticulous attention to detail, Lucille Ball's pursuit of perfection was evident during the filming of shows and movies. Joan Rivers, who worked with the producer, witnessed this firsthand. She observed Ball's insistence on precise camera angles, which frequently turned out to be accurate. This commitment to excellence was just one aspect of the challenges directors faced when working with the legendary figure. The director Jack Carter also found it difficult to handle Lucille Ball because of her strong will and perfectionist nature. He discovered that managing her required striking a delicate balance between being assertive and flexible. Her unwavering dedication to delivering top-notch performances could sometimes make collaborative work challenging, but ultimately rewarding. Despite these difficulties, many professionals involved in producing films and television shows admired Ball's high standards and appreciated how they contributed to creating this classic entertainment. As production teams navigated through their projects, maintaining harmony while catering to Ball's expectations remained crucial. They had to learn quickly what worked best when interacting with a determined artist, acknowledging her expertise yet guiding her towards realizing shared goals. With time, patience, and understanding, they achieved remarkable results together. Born on August 6, 1911, in Jamestown, New York, Lucille Ball was the daughter of Henry Durrell Ball, a lineman for Bell Telephone Company, and Desiree Evelyn Hunter. Her father's untimely death when Lucy was just three years old left her mother to support the family as a telegraph operator. This challenging start in life would shape Lucy's resilient personality and strong work ethic. Growing up, Lucy had two brothers, Fred and Henry Jr., and the siblings shared a close bond. She attended Jamestown Public Schools and developed an interest in acting and dance during her high school years. After graduation, she pursued her passion by moving to New York City and studying drama under the guidance of Martha Graham and Anna Held. During her time in NYC, Lucy encountered several influential figures who shaped her career. One of them was Burt Wheeler, a vaudeville star who encouraged her to pursue comedy roles. Another significant influence was Sam Goldwyn, a film producer who gave her minor roles in movies like Roman Scandals and Stage Door. These experiences allowed Lucy to learn about the entertainment industry firsthand. Lucy also met her future husband and collaborator, Desi Arnaz, while working in Hollywood. Their partnership resulted in the creation of the groundbreaking television show I Love Lucy, which premiered in 1951 and became one of the most popular series in TV history. Together they formed Dezilu Productions, making them pioneers in the entertainment business. Throughout her life, Lucille Ball faced numerous challenges but persevered through hard work and determination. With support from her family, mentors, and colleagues, she built a successful career as both an actress and a producer, leaving behind a lasting legacy in the world of entertainment. Today, Lucille Ball continues to inspire aspiring performers, seeking to break into the competitive field of show business. Even as a child, Lucy showed a knack for making people laugh. She loved performing little skits and shows for her family and neighbors. But it was during her time at the John Murray Anderson School for the Dramatic Arts in New York City that she had a moment that truly sparked her passion for comedy. 
One day, while practicing a serious Shakespearean monologue, Lucy stumbled and accidentally said a line with a funny twist. Her classmates burst into laughter, and Lucy realized that making people laugh brought her more joy than anything else. From then on, she dedicated herself to perfecting her comedic timing and delivery. After moving to Hollywood, Lucy faced numerous setbacks and rejections. However, her unwavering determination and infectious humor eventually caught the attention of CBS executives. They gave her the opportunity to star in a new television show called I Love Lucy. The rest, as they say, is history. Lucy's ability to find humor in everyday situations resonated with audiences worldwide. With every slapstick stunt and hilarious misunderstanding, she left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. And even today, decades after her passing, we can still appreciate the creative spark that ignited Lucy's passion for bringing laughter to millions. In the face of numerous obstacles, Lucille Ball emerged as a trailblazer in the entertainment industry. Born on August 6, 1911, Ball's journey was marked by financial struggles and industry skepticism. Raised during the Great Depression, she experienced poverty firsthand, which instilled in her a strong work ethic and determination. Despite her humble beginnings, Ball aspired to become an actress. However, she encountered significant resistance from studio executives who deemed her unattractive and lacking star quality. Unfazed by their criticisms, Ball honed her craft through rigorous training and perseverance. She even went so far as to bleach her hair blonde to stand out in a sea of brunettes. One of the most notable challenges Ball faced was breaking free from the stereotypical roles offered to women at the time. Rather than succumbing to typecasting, she took matters into her own hands. Alongside her husband, Desi Arnaz, Ball formed Azilu Productions, becoming one of the first female studio heads in Hollywood. This bold move allowed her to produce and star in I Love Lucy, a groundbreaking sitcom that would captivate audiences worldwide. However, launching Dezilu came with its share of complications. To secure funding, Ball and Arnaz had to mortgage their home and convince wary investors to take a chance on them. Moreover, they pioneered new production techniques, including filming episodes before live audiences and utilizing multiple cameras. These innovations revolutionized the television industry and paved the way for future productions. Lucille Ball's story serves as a testament to the power of resilience and creativity in overcoming adversity. Her ability to adapt and find innovative solutions enabled her to break barriers and leave an indelible mark on the entertainment landscape. After years of honing her craft in vaudeville and radio, Lucy's big break came when she starred in the CBS sitcom, I Love Lucy. Airing from 1951 to 1957, the show became a ratings powerhouse, making Lucille Ball a household name. Co-star and real-life husband Desi Arnaz recalled, We knew we had something special, but the reaction was beyond our wildest dreams. Critics agreed, praising Ball's impeccable comedic timing and physical comedy skills. A pivotal moment in Ball's career arrived when she formed a Zillu Productions with Arnaz. As one of Hollywood's first female studio heads, Ball broke barriers in the entertainment industry. Director William Asher, who worked closely with Ball on several projects, noted, Lucy wasn't just talented, she was a trailblazer. She proved that women could excel both in front of and behind the camera. One notable example of Ball's producer prowess was her decision to shoot I Love Lucy on film using the three-camera setup, which allowed for reruns and syndication deals. This innovation revolutionized television production and solidified the show's lasting legacy. Another milestone in Ball's career was her role in the groundbreaking feature film The Long, Long Trailer, where she once again demonstrated her flair for physical comedy alongside her husband. Upon its release in 1954, critic Bosley Crowther wrote, has never been funnier proving herself a true comic force. Throughout her illustrious career, Lucille Ball left an indelible mark on the entertainment landscape, inspiring countless performers and producers along the way. Her innovative spirit and dedication to excellence continue to resonate today, ensuring that her contributions will captivate audiences for generations to come. Renowned for her comedic talent, Lucille Ball approached her work with infectious enthusiasm and a knack for physical comedy. Born on August 6, 1911, in Jamestown, New York, Ball's early life was filled with dreams of performing. She found herself attracted to the glamour and excitement of Hollywood. Lucille Ball's artistic vision was deeply rooted in her own experiences. Having grown up during the Great Depression, she learned the value of hard work and resilience. These qualities became central themes in her productions, often showcased through relatable 
everyday situations spiced with humor and lightheartedness. One of Ball's most significant contributions to television is I Love Lucy, which she produced and starred in alongside her real-life husband Desi Arnaz. This groundbreaking series incorporated many innovative techniques still used today, including filming in front of a live studio audience and utilizing multiple cameras. By embracing these cutting-edge approaches, Ball left an indelible mark on both the entertainment industry and future generations of producers. I Love Lucy also served as a platform for Ball to challenge gender norms. As a producer, she demonstrated that women could excel in positions of power within the industry. Furthermore, her character, Lucy Ricardo, frequently defied societal expectations by pursuing her dreams and proving that women were capable of achieving success in various fields. The influence of Lucille Ball extends far beyond her impressive body of work. Her ability to captivate audiences remains unmatched, resonating even among those who never experienced her artistry firsthand. To step into the world she created is to witness a testament to perseverance, ambition, and laughter, all integral components of her lasting legacy. Her impact transcends time, leaving behind a vibrant tapestry etched into the annals of history. Picture. This a bustling landscape where creativity thrives, fueled by the passion and dedication of one extraordinary woman. Without a doubt, Lucille Ball was a trailblazer in the entertainment industry. As a producer, she defied conventions and left an indelible mark on comedy and television production. Inaki Midag, a professor specializing in American media, describes Ball as a game changer who broke barriers and paved the way for future generations. Lucille Ball's groundbreaking TV series, I Love Lucy, premiered in 1951. With her husband Desi Arnaz, Ball formed their own production company, Dezilu Productions. This move allowed them to take creative control over their show, something unheard of during that era. By becoming producers, Ball and Arnaz demonstrated that women could excel in leadership roles behind the camera. I Love Lucy introduced various innovative techniques still used today. One such innovation was filming episodes before a live studio audience, enhancing viewer engagement and creating a more intimate atmosphere. According to media historian David Weinstein, this approach revolutionized sitcom production, making it feel more spontaneous and realistic than previous shows. Moreover, Ball championed diversity both on screen and off. She insisted on integrating African-American actors into I Love Lucy when others resisted. Her commitment to inclusivity laid the foundation for greater representation in Hollywood. As a testament to her impact, countless comedians and industry professionals cite Lucille Ball as an inspiration. Tina Fey once said, Lucy proved you didn't need to play the ingenue or the damsel in distress. You could be funny, smart, and powerful all at once. Allison Hannigan admires Ball for showing that being silly can be incredibly strong and brave. To sum up, Lucille Ball's contributions extend beyond her iconic performances. Through her producing prowess, she transformed the television landscape and fostered a culture of creativity, empowerment, and inclusion. Reflecting on her legacy, journalist Mary McNamara notes, Ball showed us that laughter knows no bounds, and neither should ambition. Lucille Ball, best known for her role as Lucy Ricardo on the classic TV show I Love Lucy, had a rich personal life filled with passion and values that extended beyond the entertainment industry. Born on August 6, 1911, in Jamestown, New York, Ball's humble beginnings shaped her perspective on life and informed her career choices. Growing up, Ball experienced financial hardships, which sparked her desire to help those less fortunate later in life. She was actively involved in various charitable organizations and even established her own foundation, the Lucy Desi Arnaz Center, dedicated to preserving her legacy while supporting local community programs. Lucy valued family above all else. Her marriage to Desi Arnaz, despite its challenges, lasted six decades until his passing. Together, they raised two children, often incorporating family dynamics into their productions, reflecting her commitment to maintaining strong familial bonds. This emphasis on relationships also translated onto set, where she fostered a nurturing environment for cast and crew members alike. Passionate about animal rights, Ball used her influence to advocate for animals. After retiring from television, she became increasingly active in PETA, advocating against cruelty towards animals and promoting responsible pet ownership. Moreover, Ball was a trailblazer for women in Hollywood. As one of the first female studio heads, she paved the way for future generations of women producers and directors. Despite facing gender discrimination during her early years in acting, 
Ball persevered, turning obstacles into opportunities. Thus, delving deeper into Lucille Ball's life reveals a woman deeply committed to social issues, family, and equality. Although celebrated primarily for her comedic genius, it is clear that Ball's personal values significantly influence both her professional and private lives. Without a doubt, Lucille Ball left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. As a producer, she challenged norms and pushed boundaries, creating groundbreaking content that resonates even today. Her show I Love Lucy was one of the first to feature a pregnant lead character, and used innovative filming techniques like live audiences and multiple cameras. This allowed for a more engaging viewing experience and paved the way for modern sitcoms. For those looking to follow in her footsteps, Ball would likely offer some valuable advice. First, never shy away from taking risks and challenging conventions. It's often through these efforts that true innovation occurs. Additionally, always stay true to yourself and your vision, even if others may not immediately understand or appreciate it. Finally, surround yourself with talented individuals who share your passion and dedication to the craft. With hard work, perseverance, and a little bit of luck, you too can leave a lasting impact on the industry. Indeed, Lucille Ball's journey in the entertainment industry was nothing short of remarkable. Born on August 6, 1911, she began her career as a model before moving on to vaudeville and film. However, it was television where Ball truly left her mark. In 1951, she produced and starred in I Love Lucy, which became an instant hit among audiences. What set Ball apart was not just her comedic talent, but also her innovative approach towards production. She insisted on shooting episodes live before a studio audience, ensuring authenticity and enhancing viewer engagement. Moreover, she formed Zillu Productions alongside her husband, further demonstrating her entrepreneurial spirit. Under her leadership, Dezillu pioneered many technical advancements like multiple camera setup shoots and electronic editing systems, revolutionizing TV production methods. Even after her divorce from Desi Arnaz, Ball retained ownership of Dezillu, making her one of Hollywood's few powerful female executives during that era. After selling Dezillu in 1967, Ball continued acting, producing, and mentoring upcoming talents until her death in 1989. Her work resonates even today, underscoring the power of creativity and persistence. Lucy's story serves as a testament to the fact that passion, when combined with relentless determination, can create legacies that transcend time. Here was a woman who started as a contract player, eventually becoming a producer, studio owner, and icon, all while raising a family and maintaining her signature humor intact. Her influence extends far beyond the realms of comedy or television, reminding us that every step we take towards our dreams matters, regardless of how small they may seem initially. Let's take a moment to appreciate the remarkable contributions of Lucille Ball, a true pioneer in television production. Born on August 6, 1911, she left an indelible mark on the industry through her groundbreaking work. She was not just an actress, but also a savvy businesswoman who co-founded Dezillu Productions with her husband, Desi Arnaz. Together, they produced numerous successful shows like I Love Lucy, which still resonates with audiences today. Her innovative approach to comedy and storytelling paved the way for future generations. Her character, Lucy Ricardo, became an iconic figure in American pop culture. Despite facing many challenges in a male-dominated field, Lucille Ball continued to push boundaries and prove herself as a force to be reckoned with. She proved that women could excel both in front of and behind the camera. Now it's your turn. What do you think about Lucille Ball's work and legacy? Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed our tribute, please remember to hit the like button, share this video with others, and don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating stories about the creative minds shaping entertainment.